I'm with Dan and Chris from Three Four, and we're talking about a new universe. Yeah, so, how have you guys been? Not too bad. Now, how long has it been in development for, by the way? Uh, we've been working on this game for about three months so far. Um, yeah. <laughs> hey, what's your job on the project? Uh, mine's a programmer. Um, same with Chris here, he's a programmer. Uh, he does more gameplay, I do the lots of shaders and stuff like that. Yeah. Yep. And what platforms are you targeting for this game? Uh, we're targeting touch enabled devices, so things like iPhone and Android. Uh, we're pretty keen to bring it on to uh, things like um, tablets and whatnot as well. So what was the concept behind the game? Okay, um, so the game is a basically, uh, well the easiest way to describe it in a little bit is it's a Tamagotchi in space. So it's all about um, having your own ship, keeping your ship alive. So you've got these five vital stats and you need to keep those up. So things like fuel, oxygen and all that, you need to keep them up. And when you're not playing the game, they will still tick down. So you need to make sure you log on like once a day or so to keep them up. Uh, but that's just the beginning of the game. So once you've dealt with the vitals, just like in real life, you can go and do other things then, right? So once you eat, you're good to go do something else. Same thing in this. So once you're good there, you go and mine other resources like metal. Metal allows you to build new ship parts. You can put it all together. You can customize it. It's just like a big Lego ship that you get to build. The scale, color, that's all under your control. You move it around. So elements of microtransactions or you staying clear from that? Complete free to play uh, with microtransactions, but we are not going down the route of pay to win at all. It's nice. just pay to like uh, speed processes up. Essentially. So, so everything can be done, just takes time to do it. Definitely, yeah. Very, very nice. And uh, so the real kick with this game is that although we do have AI that you can go and battle to take their resources, we have a server, a matchmaking server set up, and when you come into a, um, a new solar system, you'll actually be paired with another active player and you'll be able to battle it out with that person or just trade or just leave each other alone it's totally up to you but the real cool thing is is that every time you beat a player you get reputation that reputation is publicly available you want to go after the number one guy in the universe that's ruling that universe you can take him down very very nice yeah. sounds really really cool yeah yeah it's it's a game that um you can pick up play for five minutes and it's nice and casual but the more you play it the more you realize it's really has all this depth to it and we hope that uh, hardcore players such as ourselves can really get into this game and um, really enjoy it um, for free, basically. So, yeah, sounds great. AIE, correct? Definitely. Um, yeah. yeah. How's it been going for you? Excellent. Uh, so we're part of the incubator course currently. Uh, so we're graduates from their advanced diploma course. And um, yeah, uh, we're currently working with the incubator. So very nice. Any other future plans or future projects? Yeah, we have another project on the go at the moment called Project Rebuild uh, that we're working on. Uh, that one's a little larger scope, so that's why we're working on this one first. Originally, this was supposed to be our kind of break project that was going to be smaller, but it turned into a big project later on. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Well, I'll tell you, it looks very fantastic. Thank Reminds you of Homeworld, which is a good thing, by the way. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Seriously, good luck with it. I hope it goes well for you. Thank you very much. Dan, Chris, pleasure talking to you guys.